I'm going to show you how to fix Fallout 3 crashing on Epic Games, so make sure to follow my methods. First of all, you should go to the Windows taskbar, click on this upside arrow. If you do find the Epic Games launcher appearing right here, right click on it and select exit. After that, go to the Windows taskbar again, right click on any empty space and select task manager. Now once this appears, make sure to keep the usages of the CPU and memory under 100% to prevent any issue happening. To do that, you need to look for any process that is useless or you don't want to be running. Just select it, right click and then select enter task after that go to the search and type in epic games if you still find it appearing right here you need to terminate this process so right click on it and select in task once done you need to go to the windows icon and then look for settings select windows update and make sure to download the latest updates if you do have pending or failed updates make sure to go to the update history deselect the first two options scroll down and select recovery now make sure to select reinstall now and before you do that select the first option select other troubleshooters you will see the windows update element select run and see if that solves your issue now next go to the search and type in nvidia make sure to open this nvidia app if you do have an nvidia graphics card you should find it appearing otherwise go to their official website download it from there now once done go to drivers and make sure to download the latest available driver select this download button after that go to settings and make sure to switch off the nvidia overlay like this you need to sign up with an account or log in with your existing one before that so once done you can close this now you need to open the launcher once again from here you need to go to the library look for fallout your game now your game must be installed so all you have to do is to select these three dots and then you will find this manage option you need to click on it from here you need to select verify in order to verify the integrity of game files it will start by downloading any corrupted or missing file that possibly causing the issue so don't panic once you do that now all you have to do is to restart your computer then see if the problem is gone if you do find it helpful consider subscribing and see you on the next one